All right, we are back. All right, we are back. We are good. Life is good. All right, we are all set. Not dropping any frames. Everything looks clean. So. Yeah, we have an excellent quality now. So good stuff. Life is good. All right. Let's go Ironworks. All right, here we go, guys. Round one. We're top playing Telemochus. In an ex extremely fun game. Hopefully, I do not have to keep punning the whole time, but I will end up doing so anyway. All right. Let's rock our socks off. Alright, well, let's see, um... Yeah, I mean... Kinda don't like Banefire in there, but... We can get it back, because we do run... Um... Yeah, we're we're okay here. So we will keep this. Cause we're on the draw too. So and he's mulliganing already. So this is a good thing for us. Oh. Well, that's going to be a problem. So he's looking at my hand, he's probably wondering what's going on. Alright, so he's going to take my uh, Lotus Bloom. That slows me down a little bit, but... That leaves me a lot of live draws. 
I mean, he could have taken Banefire, but I think he realizes I can just get it back. Or he's just going to go completely ballistic and take everything from me. I didn't see Inquisition in his list. Alright, so we're cracking some eggs, we're gonna start playing some eggs and we're gonna crack them. And I think we're in a good spot. Holy God! Alright, well, we're not going anywhere. He's still got a one lander. But he's taking my Banefire. But, right on Q, we have a Crack Clan. So, right now I have no way to get back my Faiths. So we could go off, but there's no guarantee I would draw into a land. So, so we're going to Icker. All right, so we go off this turn. Let's draw three. There's a reshape. Do this. We're gonna white, white, open. It's gonna get everything back. Um. Let's see what else we draw. I wouldn't mind. Now we drew some more. Wouldn't mind getting into a reshape. Alright, so we're going to reshape for three, sack of land, uh, get Codex Shredder, sack Codex Shredder for Faiths. Actually, no. Um, let's see, that's six mana. But we're down five. So we'll be doing 14 to him. So what am I to get back? Because it comes back to hand. It's really rough. Um...
So daddy is doing what daddy does best. And that is stream. Alright, well. Didn't draw into it. So we're going to take three. Beautiful. Alright, um, do this. I don't have anything to draw though. Oh, man. I would have loved another open the vaults. I should have popped it for white and not blue. That reshape was greedy on my part. I'd almost say that was a punt. All right, we gotta make it work this turn. Let's, all right, well, this might work. We're gonna try it. Hey, baby. Alright. Woo! Woo! That's called saving thy butt. That saves my butt. Okay, we're gonna go white. Uh, we'll go red. And now we are having an explosive game. Let's keep on cracking because we do need to get back. Sack five. Banefire. Yep, he knows it's coming. Alright, so Mono Black. Uh, he's got Pack Rat, so that means uh, Pithing Needle the Pack Rat. And I think that's all I want. All right.
Alright, let's see what we got. So I think we're good. I didn't bring in any of my uh my hate. Um it's really loose. I don't like it. Alright, we'll go with this. That's fantastic for us on top. <sighs> well, there goes our turn one play. See if he leads it up with a Thoughtseize. Nope. Pack rat. That's annoying. Alright, we'll crack that. Do that. Let's see if he goes on the pack rat plan. Wouldn't mind drawing into a pithing needle to just stop pack rat right now. Hey, don't hit the fish tank. Yep, we are on the pack rat plan. Pithing needle, please. No pithing needle yet. Oh, this is going to be so quick. Alright, so Sphere... I think he's got me this one. Alright. Yep. Yep. That will happen. Pack Rat is disgusting. Alright. So we're on the play. We're going to bring in some Echoing Truce. Get rid of sphere, get rid of one reshape. And I need to leave the codex shredder in, so um one spirit guide. Alright, so that seems better. What are you doing over there, Caitlin? You're looking at the fishies? Ah. So you're silly. Daddy, you Daddy's streaming. Can you say hi, everyone? Can you say hi? No, you're going to be shy. Let's see if he gets rid of my cantrip or my echoing truth. If he gets rid of the echoing truth, I'm pretty sure we're going on the pack rep plan. 
We get rid of the cantrip. We're just trying to play a longer game. You're silly. Daddy streaming. Yeah. All right, so let's say I'm not, I don't think he can exile my graveyard at all. I don't think he's got anything like that in his tech. Let's check. No, but we are on the pack rat plan. So we need to shut pack rat down pretty quick. Echoing Truth wouldn't be the worst thing here. Yeah? You gotta go get it, baby girl. Daddy turn? Daddy's playing right now. Daddy can't have a turn. Oh boy. Are you okay? She just stepped on that. You okay? You okay? I'm sorry. Alright, so... Oh, I hate that rat. So we could use a timely uh, echoing truth here. Good news is I can open the vault. Um, leave up a blue mana. See if we get lucky. That or pithing needle. So. Because we got three more echoings and a pithing, two more pithing needles. Oh, he's gonna play obliterator. Okay, so that's it's actually not. I'm okay with that, and that's an absolutely huge draw. All right, so let's do this. Do that. Do that. Do that. And then we're going to pith. Pack rat. And we're going to white, white. See what we draw. All right, we got a face. And pack right again. see we can get uh, 13 14 15 16 17 18 let's see we're gonna take six we're gonna take 11 next turn I oh, know we'll only take I'm fine with that. So we'll take 
nine right now, unless he's got a Gary. If he's got a Gary, we're kind of boned. Okay, so gatekeeper is fine. Gatekeeper is fine. All right, so let's see. I'll take those back to back. Let's see what we draw. Uh, play an island. Should have saved that face. God, that was greedy. Um, that's four, that's nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 14 damage I can do. So, let's go for it. That's it. Eh, we weren't seeing much. I mean, we would have a major cycle. So. Oh well, my friends. All right, he scrambled my eggs, guys. Well, Daddy lost the first round. Really good out of the gate, and then we went like this. So, all right, guys, we should be starting up. It looks like everyone's reporting in. I think we're just waiting on Hoogland's match to finish up. So the next deck we're going to be going against, um, if you guys are wondering where I'm seeing all this, um, did I... Name it pairing. Alright. So, pairing wise, I have Z Boy next, which is his troll worship deck. So, um, it's 
going to be a little hard. And by a little bit, I mean a lot of it. I'll upload it so you guys can see the deck. Uh, card hoarder. Let's go to downloads. That would be today. Z boy. Troll. So. Basically, he's playing Troll Warp Worship, which is Troll Aesthetic, and but he's got like Witch Stalker in there, some Sun Titans, a Sigarda, and yes, Worship, because that's part of the deck, you know, can't kill it, Worship. But see, Worship doesn't matter to me, and his beaters aren't... It doesn't worry me too much it's his sideboard um with the tormod's crip the disenchants and the eidolons so he's got a lot of game in against me in his sideboard so we'll basically have to pick where we go off and uh yeah see how it happens So, because it's one of those, it could be a big pain in the butt, but we will see. Uh, pairing should be, or we should be ready to rock. Alright, so that was good games. I am not too worried there. So, let's hope we can pick it up against this. Um, let's see where Hoogland's at. Let's see, what's Hoogland got going on? It looks like they're just in game two or three. So. We're just waiting for Hoogland to finish up in the good old Jeffer. But tomorrow, oh, tomorrow do I have a surprise for you all. Oh, we have a surprise for you guys tomorrow. So, and then what else do we play tonight? We play Orz's Blue White Control. That should be really interesting. Let me grab it and you'll see this deck we'll talk about it a little bit and then we'll talk about hopefully our charity stream soon enough because that's the next thing on my uh, agenda shall we say all right so ors deck Is playing all sorts of
Literally, I have most of his deck. It's a cyborg, but that's whatever. Um, yeah, the cyborg's a little bit of a pain with the four meddling mages and the four Eidolons of Rhetoric. But Eidolon hurts him too, so... I mean, technically I could Equig Truth something and I'd just go Ballistic. Hopefully. Uh, it's just going to be really hard. Games 2 and 3. So. I think we are all ready to rock. So we have some things out of this deck too. But I have another deck I'm working on. So hope you guys are having a good night. Right now what we're playing is Ironworks. Good old Ironworks. Normally I'd say I'd host. But there's Hooglin's the only one left. He's going against Storm. And Restore Balance. So that that's interesting right there. So we got Storm, so if you guys want to check it out, um, you can check it out there um, at the multi-stream. That's where we all are, but you can watch Hooglins there and uh, see what he's doing. He's got a really interesting on a Restore Balance take. And I don't remember who he's playing. Oh, I can look. That's always the key. Oh, Trey Gamer. Oh, and Z Boy is still going, and Bruce Brew Guy. So we got Gifts and uh, Troll Worship too. So what was really cool about this guy is the Hunter Ticket Challenge. Normally, you would see um, like just kind of like net decks. People kind of looking for that, and really, honestly, I can say, um, even Saffron Olive said the same thing. It, we all expected a lot of net decks. That's why I picked this, because it preys on the net decks for the most part when you're talking 100 tickets. But a lot of people went out and brewed, and that was just really cool about it. Um, I'll tell you what, the amount of brewing that went on is just awesome. And that's what Team Card Hoarder is about, is getting the community involved. And a lot of these streamers got their community involved and helped them brew and test. and It was just really cool to see, because um, I'm a builder by heart, so I knew I was going to build something completely silly. And, uh, yeah, we built it. So, so let's see where Z-Boy is at. Bruce guy, let's see, buy the spy, magic guy, see what he's doing. Oh, that game looks spicy. That game looks spicy right there. So he's casting a gifts to do something silly. He's going against there's only there's really two troll worship decks. So I don't want to jump into a new game because I don't know if they're... The only good news is Worship. I don't know if he's got a D-Sphere. Oh, he's got an O-Ring. Okay. So he's running O-Ring. 
Gideon, Elizabeth. Okay, so he's getting some silly stuff. So either he's going to get a Gideon and an Elizabeth, or two things that will fix whatever he's doing. Seems good. Wish we could host with commentary so I could host for you guys. You guys could watch it as a uh, as it's happening. So next up, I have Z-Boy, who's still in game. We have one game left, guys. That's Z-Boy and at so he is gifting still. He's trying to figure out what he's gifting. But he does have Aesthetic out and Worship. So he's got to get the Worship out, or the Gone, basically. So give me one second here. Yeah, I think that was the smartest play. I definitely think that was the smartest play for him. He's going after D-Sphere, O-Ring, and... I'm watching what he's doing, so once we're ready to rock and roll, guys, we'll start round two. We're in the middle of this. I got ratted out the first game. Who thought Mono Black was still around? Not me. So, no, he made a change. It's Souls, Land. So he did some weird things. Oh, he's got a Blood Baron out, so... What's up, Drunk Gaming? Shots? What's up, Thomas? I'm just watching the last game right now. Between Bruce Spy. I'm watching his point of view. Here comes an Iona. Natural casted Iona. That's disgusting. So we have a natural cast of Iona. He has a Blood Baron. I'm assuming Iona named Green. Because this is Troll Worship, and there's really. Unless it's going after White, which is the Paths. So. Yeah, it went after White, so. Because there's a Harmonize. But Ironworks combo, I will say, is fun. And it's exactly what I thought it was. Uh, game one, we're favored like 90% of the time. Fantastic game one. Games two and three... I'm not dropping fl frames.
Well, I'm getting saying I'm choppy. Let me turn up my mic a little bit. I'll turn up my mic a little bit. There we go. So. This looks like it could be fun. Alright, so he's trying to block the Iona. He's trying to stay alive. Troll Worship's in a bad spot. Gifts is, uh... Very thankful I'm not playing Gifts this week. Let's just say that. So, just wait until this game looks like it's just about over. And there's a path targeting the birds. And that's game right there. Well, I think they are done. So we are on to round two, my friends. Alright, round two is coming up right now. Uh, I've got Z-Boy. Let me, uh... Get things figured out with him. We'll go back to the deck as I figure that out with him. Alright, shall we have an excellent time? By egg, I mean excellent time. So let me get him challenged up. We can go into uh, round two. Iron works. Alright, so we'll concede. Alright, that's everyone. Alright. We're good. Let's rock it. Round two. With the Egg-tastic deck. Alright. 
Alright. Hey, Daddy. Hi, baby. Can you say hi to everyone on stream? Can you say hi? Go hi. No, you're just giving that cute smile. You're nothing but trouble, baby girl. Alright. So I'm just waiting for the okay from Z-Boy, and uh, we'll get things all set to go. And uh, round two. Eggs versus the world. We're just waiting for our person to say, uh, Fire Shoes, I did not win the first match. Sadly, Eggs went off and did exactly what it should do in uh, game one. And then uh, games two and three, yeah. Just wasn't in the cards. So... It is a, it is a happening. It does happen, I guess you could say. No, it's okay. Eggs was a lot of fun. We did some silly things. I mean. By that, we did some very silly things. So we're just waiting for Z-Boy to get ready and come back and... Uh, off we go. Number two. Now remember, tomorrow night, guys, I have something real special going on. Um, this is the other deck that would have gotten played if I had another week. Let's just say that. Are you making... What are you making? Oh, is it good stuff? Alright, so here we go, guys. Game or match number two. <laughs> Eggs crack easy. And I won the die roll. That's actually really good for me. Um... Yeah, this is a fantastic keep, so we're just going to keep this. And the puns have started. Alright. Yeah. Alright, so... Alright, so let's do this, do this, do that, and might as well do that. Z-Man's on troll, uh, troll worship. Basically the whole goal is to get trolls aesthetic out and then uh, worship. So you can't lose the game. Ever. Whew. We 
you got some uh you got some eggs let's see if we can draw some lands All right, so we're getting kind of desperate here. We're uh, cranking up the Llanowar Elves. Yeah, what is it? Oof. We gotta go off sooner than later. So we got a blue source. We can thought cast. We could take three. We could take nine next turn. Um, but I think we win next turn. Yeah. I mean, at least we generate a massive ton of mana. So this is nine. That's fine. Let's see if we can go full on combo. All right. Let's see. We'll do that. All right, so we got a worship out of him. All right, so crack, 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 white. Let's see what we draw, because we got to do other things. We got another fifth. Crack that, crack that, crack that. All right, so we got three phase. We want to draw the card. Bloom for grins. We are having an, an explosive turn. Yes, I want there, guys. All right, so let's face. Draw four. Is there any spirit guide reshape? All right, so let's dark steel. All right, we got an open the vaults, so let's reshape for zero. Sack this out this time, get the other Lotus, go white. And then Crack, 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 crack. We're cracking the eggs. New. No. Um. Let's the more times we can get around. We're gonna go white for that. Keep on going. Draw four more. All 
All right, so let's. All right, another Icker. So we're just gonna get deep into our deck here. All right, there's our Banefire, so we win. Sack, sack. All right, and exile one. Actually, let's cancel that. Let's crack. I didn't realize he's at 32 life. Drawing on that one. Not drawing, not drawing. All right, now let's bane fire him. Bane fire for a lot. Eh. I always like to go ten over. There we go. And that's that. All right, so game number two. All right, so that was uh, game one. Game number two, we're gonna bring in Pith. We're going to bring an Echoing Truce. I don't think he has anything that can shoot against me. He's got Idol on a Rhetoric, which could be a pain. But the Crypt, the Disenchants. Either way, we're going to have a lot of uh, hard ones to keep here. So we're going to get rid of these two. We're going to get rid of a reshape. And one spirit guide. So our goal is to hopefully... He misses 90% of what he has. And we just had an explosive game one, so. Uh, no, this is a mulligan. This is a keep. And that makes it a lot better. So he has no discard for me, so I can keep stuff and go to town on it. All right, so Land of War. We'll play that and then that. That ramps us nicely. But yeah, tomorrow guys, I promise, tomorrow's gonna be Pretty awesome game. All right, so that just tells me there's a lot going on there. If he's attacking in with Lanawar, he's on one land. I was about to say he's either on one land or. Oh, I love it. All right, there's an echoing truth. Yeah. Ah. Yeah. All right, so. Uh, Witch Stalker is going to be a pain because that's hexproof. All 
Alright, we'll play that. Right now, I'm in an okay spot. I mean, it's not where I technically want to be. But I do have a reshape, so I can go get... Right now, it's only a reshape for three. You know, and I'm not... Worship's a pain, but it's not a game ender. Hey. Yep, yeah, we're gonna cast that. Alright, so... I mean, right now there's nothing really happening. Yeah, that's fine. Alright, so... Alright, let's go... Pith... And then we're gonna go... We're gonna pit the Stirring Wildwood. So I got four mana, five mana, so I can reshape for three. Um, still not what I want. If we get a KCI, I think we're online. So you can do it for two. Alright, so you can equip. I think we might die. And no, I think we live one more turn. So I think we have a chance to get a KCI one more turn. Nope. Alright, so... Um... Quicker to get Emrakul out. Yeah, let's go the Emrakul plan. Because I can do 15 mana pretty quickly in rotation. Um, no, even though it's a fantastic keep. Nah, this is fine. Uh, yeah, that's great. So we'll play... Alright, so we get the thought cast, which is great. That got us too deeper, and that wasn't the two we wanted, so... Man, it was good to get a Chromatic Star. I can crack. Ugh.
taking seven this turn. Gonna have to come up with something real quick here. We're flooding out here, guys. Um, we'll hold up Stirring Wildwood, I guess. For we'll hold up mana for Echo and Quarter. Yep, we'll kill it. We'll take six. Go down to three. We draw land. This is just poor draws, unfortunately. Nope, we may have drawn our out. Oh my gosh. Really? All right, well, that's it for this one, guys. And yet again, the 2-1. Alright, so what I'm going to do is for the next umpteen time, we're going to uh, host uh, one of our guys. Host. Is it Spy Guy? I think it is. Let's see. Brew Spy the Magic Guy. Alright. So I'm going to go offline. <laughs> 